Good day, everyone. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. Uh, before we start covering all the automated trade, I would like to show you uh, something here. Uh, that's what happened today. So we are about done for today. And now is 12.57 uh, p.m. And uh, we had a sale order, if you are using an institutional time frame from 23.50, we are already hit the target at uh, 94. And then followed by a reversal and a double support. For the ones don't know our system, those two yellow lines, we've been using those for a couple, three years right now. And very rare those lines fell. As you see here, I mean, we are using the 15 minutes uh, to look the what the institutional traders are doing. And you can see how this market here, uh, expecting it to drop, and it did, and it hit the target right in line, and now we have a double reversal. Once this market hit, and now it is around 12.58, 1 o'clock, most likely the uh, rest of the day is going to be uh, in a sideway market, and it's gonna, a trader is going to get in a lot of troubles, actually, by trading. Let me show you something else. This is a 15 minutes, but uh, maybe not too many traders look at the bigger picture, so we will look at the smaller picture, a little bit more civilized picture, three minutes. This is what most of the traders uh, look at. Uh, and uh, let me show you you know, it's the same story here between those yellow lines. It doesn't matter which time frame you are using. But what I want to show you is your symmetry and the projection exactly in line where we had an entry. Those are not the repaint entry. And actually, we have uh, an automated trade for reversals, and those uh, are included in it where... Again, they do not repaint those signals, which we have a lot of traders use it in the trading, or you can use an automated trading. So this is what happened. We had a short at 51.50 on the ES, three minutes chart. Exit, re-entry uh, at uh, 705.50. And then look, this is right in the money when you have a double resistance especially to our traders, when you have a double resistance symmetry at uh, uh, 1850, that's mean it is right in the money. You cannot, um, you cannot make mistakes with it. And then we drop today exactly to the target on the three minutes. All those, you don't need to do any um, uh, uh, preparation. Those are a plot on your charts. So whether you are using an auto trade or not, uh, it is a very clear picture. Uh, a lot of small details, you cannot see it probably because you're not aware of the system. Plus, you have the true average pr price. The true average price, this one here, nobody has it, is 70250. So anything below the 70250 is short. Uh, and uh, right now, if you notice, we hit the, the target and then we have confirmation with our zone. Those are your, your uh, less than a dollar a day zone. And this is confirming, confirming the first time with a reversal, pulling back, coming back, confirming one more time, pulling back, confirming the third time. And this is right in line at 86.25. This is amazing. Right now, if you notice, we are at 1, 101 p.m. What is going to happen to this ES? Most likely this ES is going to be projecting. That's why the market now is going to go sideways because this market is going to project uh, around the uh, 98 level. Even if the market broke that level, it's going to come here and it's going to cause a sideways market, which you are not able to trade it, neither auto trade it. So this is a really keys to this ES. And uh, for people don't cannot see those keys, that you will eventually uh, get in trouble in the market without any doubt. 
Uh, for the ones who are asking us to go live, we will be going live very soon. Uh, we've been very busy. Why? We have not. We have been very, very busy releasing the new auto trade uh, to our traders. And we have activated testing. And this is the first layer of that uh, new um, auto trade. And then the second layer is coming within a week or, or two. The second phase on on this auto trade it is amazing auto trade and uh, we have already people start taking it live and uh, very good very good performance now let's go back here on the uh, price action signal this one here is based on a uh, three different um, uh, entries you can have a fully automated you can have an atm or an atm strategy we already hit the target so everything has been exited. Um, as an example, you can also use it manually, like what you see on the chart, you can have the entry, exit, this is a 15 minutes, but here we are using one minute, or if you wanted to use the three minutes, you are very welcome to use the three minutes, but normally we use in the room uh, the one minute. The market analyzer is based on one minute and one uh, lot only. So if we look at the the system here, uh, you have on the first column is a new signal come out when there is a new signal. And then we do not give you just the entry and the exit, we give you the pullback. As an example here, if we notice here, we are expecting those trailing stops comes with the automated trading. And those are fib line, florin fibs. So we already hit the target does not mean you are done with the trading. We know, we predict where the market is going to be re-entered from, and that's why we give you on the market analyzer the re-entry point on it. And uh, where everybody now in this puzzle here trying to go long, thinking the short is over while we will be waiting here and we will be taking a trade Right there, when everybody going long, we will be going short. Uh, this is typical amateur trading. Thinking is over, and then we'll, we'll, you will see the market is going to the project from the 97 level. If the trend is strong, it will be projecting from the 702. So this is where the biggest mistake 95% of amateur trading do. And uh, we will be covering that soon. Uh, on this one here, uh, we had an entry at uh, 708, uh, 75, based on one contract, target 268475. You can trade it manually, or you can trade it automatic, or an ATM, or an ATM strategy. So on the ES, we have 47 takes, 48 takes from the entry, and then what it does, it brings you, uh, the, when the market pull back, you can, as you see, uh, right now we are getting a new signal because this is a one minute uh, new signal, but I'm using now the three minutes to show you uh, how efficient that system is. But you can use the one minute and look how this market right in line has projected, you know. This is really to the tick. So we know exactly where to enter the market, where everybody going long, and as you see, this market uh, uh, projected right in line where I have the needle and we did not even miss one tick on that. This is power, this is trading, this is accuracy. This is the zone in conjunction with the Florin Fibs uh, for less than $1 a day can really turn your trading uh, the opposite direction. So right now, this is a one minute the market analyzer is based on one minute and now all the signal has come out on the one minute and you can see right now everything has changed. As you see in the video, the, 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 uh, the NASDAQ did make over 100 tick and on and on and on. So the market uh, analyzer is based on one contract and one contract only. And uh, immediately, uh, you will get it as an example here, the NASDAQ, we're still on the NASDAQ trade. And on the NASDAQ trade, we have an entry at uh, 68.75. Uh, 
target 690825. Actually, uh, the NASDAQ has not hit it. So this is, again, is going to be causing some problems in that area here. The same story, then we give you the trailing stop, the trailing stop too. And then uh, you can do that with the stocks. You can do that with, um, with the uh, Forex. As an example, right now, we have the entry, safe entry, that's mean re-entry point, and then the target right there. The total of pips right now, it is 79, um, uh, 80, um, uh, 81 pips but uh, we are using in a mini micro account. So, so this is what uh, the 10K uh, bring you to. Uh, today, we would like to show you some of the performance on the, the new auto trade, and then we cover the, um, the swing trading and the scalping. Okay, let me show you something why I like the DAX. On the ES, you will be going back and forth, back and forth to, to earn your money. The reason I like the DAX, because no matter what you do, you always, all time frame, hit with one trade, most of the time. This one here started, so actually with the money you invest on the DAX, 753, uh, what, what you can make in one day on the DAX, if you are an aggressive trader, you make it you make it in one trade in one day on the DAX. And this is also started around 7 o'clock. Look. 2,500. Uh, all of them. All of them. All of them. All of them. No matter what you do, you always make it on the DAX. No matter what you do. Easy, one trade. This one here is a 500, as you see, but this one here, 500 and cut. It's not gonna stay uh, with the, uh, look, once it gets the 500, it's gonna stop. On this one here, even if you get the 500, it's going to your direction, it's gonna stay. Why we did this, we cut it off at 500? Uh, for management. So a trader, so a trader, once he hit the 500, uh, especially for those guys, they don't have that much, much money. I'm expecting him to stop and leave. Once the ES and NASDAQ and down zones hit the target, cut it off, leave. You know, protect your money. Uh, if you look at um, all of them, all of them at the new one, you can stops at 500 and leave the market and if you wanted to continue it is very easy what you do you just right click target hit you want to go for one more round it is very easy you just go ahead and reload and you can kick it back again and now you can see it is takes one second to reload uh, rearm your your auto trade and then you can uh, take it and you, if you want to go for next round, go for next round, but then the first round, you know, you are on the plus on the 500. So this is how uh, we are trying to, to manage with those trades and how to manage the auto trade. On the scalpers, every single scalper hit the target. I'm not going to go through it. Uh, this is the B scalper. Uh, this is an A scalper, they all hit. Uh, this is your CL, one minute scalper. Know this one here, uh, 580 ES hit target. And all those scalpers, folks, are market orders. All the scalpers are market orders. They're not, uh, they're not uh, limited order. Uh, this is an A scalper, 580, all of them $500 target. This is 650, what is this? This is a B scalper, one minute. Uh, 
this is an A scalper 150. Uh, we are we use the scalper only one minute or our 150. We don't have any other time frame. You can use the scalper 150 tick or one minute A scalper or B scalper. 150 for aggressive traders and one minute for conservative. So there is no Renko bar. Uh, there is no um, weird charts. There is no different time frame. It is strictly 150 or takes or one minute. And uh, this is a B scalper, one minute. No, this is 150. Every single scalper chart has hit today. And this is all market order, not limited order. We use a market order on NT8, and we use a limited order on NT7. Don't ask me why, because this is the way uh, we have upgraded the NT8 with a different filter. So we use uh, the uh, the uh, the newer newer version on NT8 as a market order, and we use uh, the NT7 as a limited order. Now, if you ask me, can we use uh, the uh, limited order on NT8? Yes, of course you can use it. And actually, I like the limited order on the scalper because uh, scalping is a very small trace. Take it when the market, especially in the flat market, is looking for a new open door, open and close immediately. So I don't want to deal with the slippage. But later on, I find out some traders do not understand limited orders. So they prefer market orders and they don't mind to deal with the slippage, that's fine. So we cannot have everyone trade the same way, but we have give a lot of room to whether you wanna swing trade, scalp the market, uh, or you want it to be a little bit conservative and cut off those trades uh, immediately. Now this is uh, what uh, is going on, we have, on the one minute, we had a pullback, as, as you remember. And now we have a new target, um, uh, 696.75. If you go back to the video, we were short, and now we were going long. We had the pullback. The market is struggling, and we have showed you why this market is struggling, because I'm not expecting uh, any more um, uh, uh, today. Uh, it's not, it's gonna be between those two lines. It's going to be between the 27.10 and 27.07. This is a heavy resistance here, and we are already hit the target, so profit was taken. This market is gonna drive in those traders crazy right now in the afternoon because there is not much to do. Target was hit, and we have a lot of resistance coming in at 27.10, and that is gonna be a nightmare for a trader. Even for a guy is auto trading, he's gonna have a, a hell of a time to make money out of that. So the party is over for, for us anyway. I don't know, good luck with making uh, any ticks out of that anymore. Uh, let me see. Uh, let me show you something here on the three minutes. Especially to our trader, I wanna cover a little bit the, the true average price. If you are using one minute or three minutes, it's very fine. As long as, long as this one here is, uh, we have done it a little bit differently, and you have to really look at this uh, uh, true average price on the, which is now it is 70250. If you notice when you are trading, it's always going to be projecting, and this is really key right now. If we look, we have the trailing stop. This is uh, for your automated trade. Your automated trade already hit the target. You can see where the automated trade hit the target. One of the advantage you can do is you can reverse the market once the market hit the target. Absolutely, you can reverse the market. 
So it was designed not to make money on the way down or up. It is designed once you hit the target, you can go reversals as well. So this is a very good confirmation, especially to our traders. When you see this one here on the target, you have the symmetry fired up at 26.85. Target hit, major fib line. Those are your less than $1 a day. This is a major fib line. This is a three confirmation that it is a reversal. Three confirmation right into the money. One of the things also, as you see right now here on the three minutes, I will cover the three minutes so you can do it on one minute or on the 15 minutes, it doesn't matter, or on, on two minutes, whatever. But I'm using the three minutes because it is a middle, it's not a really low time frame and it's not really a high time frame. It's a mid-size uh, uh, chart. It's acceptable for a day trader with a limited uh, amount of money. So, again, this is a, the true average of price. Most of the time, eight out of 10, the true average of price, the market is going to project. As long if you are trading manually, now the auto trade is functioned differently, but if you are trading manually, and we know, and you all have seen that this market always project from the trading stop one and trading stop before it breaks out all those levels. We have not seen it one time. We have not seen it for the last three, four years. This is the same story day in and a day out without any question. Look at the CL. Look at the CL. Look where it's projected, right at your zone. It's coming, retracement, and look where is your average price, right there. This is a buy point. Why? The average of price is at 5042, is right between those two levels. So most likely it require a lot of sell orders to break, penetrate all those levels. One of the keys in the market is not indicators, it's level. Once you start understand your level, where is the breaking out point? And the most important things is not that. The most important is what your enemy is looking for. When this guy, we need to look at the 15 minutes, whether because they're not looking at your ranker bar. That's why you will never be a successful trader with a ranker bar. Ranker bars are beautiful for reversal, and we have covered, even on a live, uh, what uh, the ranker bars are good for. Uh, but uh, you need to look at this guy with the institutional, not your next door neighbor, with a couple of 3,000 or 10,000 or $25,000. We need to see what these guys are doing or those big companies, because those are the ones you're, you're, you need to be concerned with, not the guy next door or some guy, some, uh, guy on a web. Uh, he's, he has no impact on that market, no matter what he says, no matter what he do. The guy is doing marketing. But what we need to see what those institutionals are doing, and the institutionals, most of them, are using 15 minutes. So this is the key in the 15 minutes. We need to see where are those keys in this 15 minutes. As you see here, the ES, you don't need a guy with a light bulb to see between those two yellow lines, which we have run this uh, YouTube for. Many months is life, day in and day out. You should know those uh, yellow lines. And mainly they don't fail, eight, nine, ten percent almost. Eight out of 10, they don't fail. So we topped up on the EES, and this is really, that's what caused the chop by heavy support. Finally, they broke the heavy support, and, and all the way to the target, your target on the institutional level, is 26.94. It did come into the FIBS profit taking. It's over. So right now, look, this market is going to drive you crazy between here and there because 9.025, most likely it will hit once or twice, and this is it for today. And then it's going to be like a pinball. It's going to stay between heavy resistant, every time you see those FIB, more than one FIB in line, this is the three FIB line in conjunction with our Florin FIBs. So there is five thick walls 
and here. It's going to take a hell of a bind uh, power for that ES uh, break that level. However, on top of that is coming the true average price. So by the time that ES come into that direction, your true average price is going to be around 2710. This is a key. This is a key for your whole, um, uh, whatever you are doing. Uh, I mean, it is also key for you to know what's going on with your auto trade. You, <coughs> excuse me. You know if this auto trade immediately is gonna be making money or not. Doesn't matter what the strategy you're using. The reason is, right now we are diving into uh, uh, sideway market profit taking. So uh, this is really key, and I wanted to once we go back live every day, I want to highlight a lot about those area here because those if you don't understand those keys uh, you're sure in a blind in this market which is going to cause you a lot of problems uh, folks uh, thank you very much for today uh, uh, and uh, for our traders we'll see you on monday and uh, we have an update for you uh, then uh, there is a, a second layer come in and i will not release the second layer until i make sure every single trader uh, has accomplished uh, the, the first step on that because uh, one of the biggest mistakes we made on the institutional auto trade, the institutional auto trade is based on what, 10, 12 different entry and 23 filter. And then when we slam that uh, institutional auto trade to the traders, they got lost with it. It was too big. So, so it fired back on us and uh, then it was thus we released it. I think, I think we have released it in 2013, somewhere around there, 2013. And uh, it fired back on us. And then we find out there is uh, tons of trader. Ninety percent of the traders don't know how to optimize. And back then it was only Ninja Trader Seven. Now we are on Ninja Trader Eight. Uh, so uh, this time. Uh, we're not slamming big uh, uh, auto trades anymore. We are going a step at a time. And then we do plenty of recorded webinar for you guys uh, to go back, for the ones has not, to go back and uh, see this, uh, uh, how to control that auto trade, how to manage it. It is the most important. So on Monday, we will have um, already uh, using it and is uh, doing very well. A uh, couple bugs that were fixed. And uh, right now we will be releasing the newer update on Monday webinar. And uh, we're going to slam you with the final uh, version. We're going to put uh, the extra layer. We have uh, beautiful, amazing filters. Nobody has done it before. Uh, can su survive all the chop markets. So we, we have a lot to do uh, on that auto trade uh, uh, before we, we go back live. Uh, I want to say God bless you all. And uh, uh, since after New Year Eve, this market is not like uh, in 2018. So you got to approach it really careful. Uh, and um, um, if it's going to stay like this, uh, traders, uh, they're not, they're not going to have, if you don't have the right tools in 2019, you mark my word for it. You're not going to make it. If you don't do your homework, in 2019, trying to understand the market, even if you are auto trading, does not cost you any money to get educated, to know what you're doing. It's a difference between autopilot and airplane and know how to fly an airplane, believe me. So in 2019, what I'm looking at right now, it is a very choppy year, and I hope we're going to break out from those points. But for every trader out there, uh, don't outsmart the market. Try to respect the market and try to understand the market. Try to understand the risk in the market. Because 2019, you're not doing your homework. You're going to be out of the game. And, uh, God bless you all. Uh, see you all on Monday at the private webinar. Members only, no guests. Thank you very much. And uh, for the guests, we will be, once we are releasing the second
layer on the, because we've been getting a lot of email over that. Once we released uh, the, the second layer on the, the new auto trade um, and um, license this, uh, we will be going on a full speed uh, with a live trading. God bless you all and see you another day. Bye for now.